This video is brought to you by John Robson Guitar Tuition. If you enjoy the content, please consider supporting the channel by enrolling on a course, purchasing some guitar lessons or a t-shirt, or you can join my Patreon. Now, on with the show. Hello chaps, welcome once again to John Robson Guitar Tuition. As always, I do hope you're well. Now then, it's Friday, and I don't usually put a video up on a Friday, but I thought I'd make an exception this week. I do that occasionally. We've still got the live stream this evening, though, 5pm UK time. So, you know, we'll be having a beer and a chat then. Um, but I thought, as I say, I'd put a video up today because um, I have some content I want to share with you. Basically, uh, a couple of weeks ago on the live stream, I was joined by a very good friend of this channel, uh, Mr. Bottleneck Bob Bridge. There he is. And and as you can see, he brought a couple of guitars up with him, an Epiphone Dot Studio and a Gretsch Streamliner. Um, basically, he just said, do you want to have a play of both of these guitars and compare them? I thought, well, yeah, obviously, of course. This isn't a full review video because I didn't have enough time to kind of put that kind of video together. Uh, this is just me having a little bit of a jam with uh, a couple of Bob's guitars and forming some first impressions. So, without further ado, uh, here is uh, the jam that I did with uh, Bob's lovely guitars. pair of really nice sounding guitars I think you'd agree and um, yeah these are the settings that they were both played through you know so they were both like a level playing field um, I was using the bridge pickup on the Epiphone because that was the sound that I just preferred out of that guitar and the middle pickup uh, or the middle position on the Gretsch because again that for me was the best uh, sound coming out of that guitar for that uh, backing track that I was playing over. Um, as I said, this isn't a full review video, but I will put a link to the specs of both guitars down there in the description so you can go and check them out. Fantastic guitars. Um, if I had to choose one, I think, I think it would be the Gretsch. Um, that was the one that I, I think I enjoyed uh, the most in terms of um, just the kind of vibe of it. And it looks, um, you know, just a little bit more um, attractive, I would say, with that lovely sunburst finish. Interestingly, I couldn't find uh, that finish on any current models of this guitar. So, you know, um, 
you know, it's just one of that that finishes obviously um, a bit of a legacy thing. Who knows? Uh, the the Epiphone was a lovely guitar to play, and um, I would be more than happy if I came across one in the way that uh, Bob did. Um, it was found in a skip which for any American viewers out there, that's what we call a dumpster in the UK. And uh, a friend of Bob said, I found this guitar. Um, you know, I, I reckon they're worth about 300 quid. Um, you can have it for, like, I can't remember what Bob paid for it, but significantly, significantly less than that. And, you know, he got a very, very nice guitar as a result of it. It was a little bit uh, battered and scratched, but he did a pretty good job on, you know, kind of, I think, tea cutting or polishing the, uh, you know, the, the abrasions and the uh, the knocks out of it and it's a lovely guitar as a result you know um so occasionally you do come across something that's um you know a, a bit of a bargain like that i guess uh that solo that i played there with both guitars by the way um i'm going to do a well i have done a, a full tab of that solo which is up on my patreon page along with the backing track there's the address and the link is in the description so if you want some uh, nice laid back chilled out minor blues licks to get under your fingers then go and check that out it's only three dollars a month and you get access to all of these little extra bits and pieces that go along with these youtube videos and that's pretty much it for today folks until the live stream later i uh, hope you've enjoyed me uh, seeing me jam with a couple of bob's guitars i just want to say a massive massive thank you to bob for bringing those guitars up with with him and um you know uh, allowing me to uh, get my grubby little paws on them uh, thanks once again bob it was an absolute blast uh, but that's as I say pretty much it for today if you enjoyed the video please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell if you haven't already done so and why not give me a like while you're at it um, as I say don't forget the live stream later but for now I'll bid you all a good day and say thank you so much for watching thank you for your time look after yourselves folks stay well stay safe and above all stay sane bye for now <laughs>